guys, it is your girl Pammy from Initial POV here today and there are a few things that I really want to share with you guys and there's a lot. So I want to get started now. First things that I'm going to show you guys are clothing items. I went to Goodwill the other day and I found some really cute sweaters for fall season, especially like the big year sweaters. I love, love, love them with skinny jeans or even tights with boots. Very, very cute. I found this brand Ann Taylor loft at Goodwill and it was only $9.99. I don't know, I, I've been really liking the thick sweaters lately so I picked this up. I also picked up this really cute knit it sweater. It's like woven sweater and this is the Kelvin Klein jeans brand and I just really like the whole color and just the whole fitting. It is a medium large size but I like the baggy style for fall right now so I'm going to be wearing this a lot, a lot this season, so I really like that. And then the last sweater that I picked up from Goodwill is the one that I'm wearing right now. It's so gorgeous. I love the color and detailing of it. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's just very, very like knitted and looks like it's crocheted and I really like it. And it's a really nice neutral color where you can wear colors that pop a little bit and I've been liking it with my turquoise color so I really like that right now. Then I went to Taja Max a few weeks ago and I picked up this very cute pulpum sleeveless top. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. It's in trend right now for the season. Um, as you guys can see it's got gold specks and a sweet heart design here and it's see-through here so I mean I've worn this for my birthday if you guys follow me on Instagram it is on there and I picked up a pair of kind of MC Hammer-ish capri-like high-waisted pants, I guess. I don't know how to say it. It's got a belt here where you could tie, and I've worn this in a lot of my pictures on Instagram. There are so many ways to dress this pants up. I absolutely love it. So, And I really like the materials very light for the season right now, so I like that. Moving on to shoes. I only have one shoes for this haul. I went to Sears a few weeks ago also and they are having this amazing amazing sale and I picked up this wedge from the UK style by French Connection brand and it was only $11.99 such an amazing deal I needed some black wedges I do have a few black wedges but they're a little bit more dressier and they're a little bit bulkier and a little heavier so it's not something that I'm going to wear comfortably. So I picked these up. It literally took me 20 minutes to decide if I really wanted these. And they're absolutely gorgeous. I like the whole heel and edge to it. I like how it's thinner at the top. Like I've said in my previous videos, that's kind of my style that I like. Because I am petite, so I want something more thin at the toes and thicker by the heel. So this is absolutely going to be my favorite. And it's still wearable for fall. So I can't wait to show you guys how to dress these up. So, uh, like my video if you guys would like me to do like a fall trend video on like fashion clothing and stuff like that because I'd love to. My birthday was two, three weeks ago and I actually got some really cute stuff from my sister-in-law. She picked up a lot of things for me and I want to show you guys. And all of them are from Bath and Body Works. I'm sorry guys. I absolutely love this product. I've been using it. As you guys can tell, my husband loves it too. So, it is very, very... It's a very wearable scent for men and women, but I absolutely love it. Um, she got me the shower gel, and then she also got me the body lotion along with the body cream. Body creams, I don't wear them as much as I do in the winter, just because they're thicker, and in the summer, I don't want thick lotion on me. And then she did pick up this Chinese or Japanese cherry blossom um, hand soap and... Both of them are hand soap, I guess. One's just moisturizing and one's a gentle foaming hand soap. So I absolutely love this scent. One of my favorites from Bath & Body Works. She did also pick up some hand sanitizers for moi. And she also got me this separately. Um, here, it's just one of those where you can actually insert um, one of these hand sanitizers. And I absolutely love this for my work that I do. Um, I definitely wash my hands a lot and very often. And this is really useful for me in the field that I work for. So I absolutely love these. This is my one of my favorite scents also. This is the Aqua Blossom. I have picked or fresh picked tangerines, which is very, very, what is it? It's very citrusy smelling Japanese cherry blossom, one of my faves. 
And this one's really fruity. This is the Midnight Pomegranate, so I like that. So that's all from Bath & Body Works. And then my sister sent me a birthday present from this amazing line, the Lady Gaga's Fame Perfume. I absolutely love it. It's a killer cap. You could seriously kill someone with this, but I absolutely love it. It's one of my favorite perfumes so far. It's very fruity at the same time, sophisticated, and it's got a little twitch of vanilla in it. So I really like that, and this is just really a killer cap, but I absolutely love it. So, and it's black, and um, I believe my sister purchased this for me, and at the time, there was a gift to purchase if you buy a certain amount of products from that line. So being that said, with that purchase, my sister got a kit for me. This is a, uh, what is it, a makeup training case. This is really good for just on the go when you need a little bit of stuff in it. So it's really nice. It's not a big train case like others, but it does the job and it has a mirror and it's pretty steep so I can fit a lot of makeup in here. So moving on to makeup, I did pick up these Kiss Lashes, which are one of my faves. These are the Style 03 from Walmart, and I absolutely love these over Ardell lashes. These are absolutely my fave. I would cry if they discontinued this line or this style in particular. They do have like styles that um, are more dramatic, but I think out of all of them, this is more of my cup of tea, so I absolutely love this style. I did go to Dollar Tree, and I picked up some e.l.f. Mechanical eyelash curler. I picked up two and these are actually I didn't really expect a lot from these because obviously they're a dollar But these actually work really really good for the price I paid for um, They do have a refill in here and I've been using this a lot lately for my falsies and my actual lashes And I actually don't really curl my lashes, but this one does a great job So if you guys are looking for a very very inexpensive one, holla, I'll and then I ordered this foundation uh, off of Holt Look, and this is Stila's Natural Finish Oil-Free Makeup in shade E. It's medium coverage, which I really like. I'm not going to go into too much detail because this will be in one of my favorites video, and I absolutely love this. I paid a pretty decent price for this, so I really like this for the meantime. And then I went to Max Counter at Macy's, and I picked up a MSF in Medium Plus. This one is a little light for me, but I figured winter's around the corner, and I can bronze my face. So I picked this up, and it's definitely one of my faves of powder-wise in general. Um, I, this is my first, first one, and I absolutely love it. I did pick up a Medium Deep. Or was it medium dark? I don't remember, but it was too dark for me. And I should have kept it because I should have used it as a bronzer. Because I've seen a lot of you guys on YouTube here using that as a bronzer. So I don't know. I might go back and pick it up. And I feel like I'm talking really fast. Holy cow, I'm running out of breath. And it's it's pricey, but it's worth the money. It's like, uh, I paid $30 for that. And some other things that I picked up are... The, uh, this L'Oreal Paris Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara. It's about $6 from Walmart, and I absolutely love it. It's very black, and it does the job. So that's that. And then I did pick a lipstick from Kmart, and you can actually pick this up anywhere. This is a Sugar Plum Fury color from Wet n Wild's line. This is 908C, and I think it's a very gorgeous color for fall right now. It's really, really in, and I've been really starting this color. I personally think that this 906 c looks really, really gorgeous on darker skin tones. If you're more olive to golden and darker skin tones, it's really, really gorgeous on you. Um, I would say those who are more fair, stay away from this because it's really deep plum. So I love this. Um, I did actually... Well, my neighbor actually gave me this Revlon's Color Stay Makeup with Soft Flex. SPF 6 and this is one of my favorite foundations I've already said in my top 10 products that I would repurchase um, This one has soft flex and it's gorgeous This one's just a little bit too light for me, but I think once it hits like December or actual winter um, 280 golden beige will be my color the Michael Todd's true organics actually sent me this intensive organic cream eye treatment so I'm actually in the process of trying this out and if it does work then um, I will do a review for you for you guys then I picked up this max hold hairspray in 8 which 8 is like the maximum hold from suave and I personally don't like it if you like the strong hold this is this is the 
hairspray to go for. But um, if you don't like the tacky, dried, oily looking, then this isn't for you. And I personally don't like using hairspray in general. I bought it because my mother-in-law likes this product and it was two for five. So I did pick this up for her and she forgot it. And then like the last thing that I want to share with you guys is so random and out of the ordinary. Um, this is Mr. Clean's Magic Eraser and I love these. You can actually get these from Walmart and they're so inexpensive. I think these run for about four dollars for four of them but I actually picked mine up from Sam's Club and I got nine of them for only eight dollars so that was a steal these work amazing especially for those who are moms if you have kids or if you have siblings who are younger who love to draw on the walls this is like the best product to erase it definitely worked when I moved out of my old apartment I actually bought these because I had some scarrings from the wall from moving in to the apartment and this took out all the marks which was amazing and it works good for kitchens your bathroom and then just like any extra power like grout um, floor tiles alloy car wheels and stuff like that so and patios so it's really awesome I absolutely love this product I love it it's like my holy grail cleaner and then the last two things are something that my neighbor gave me she's the sweetest thing she is my mother I call her mother rose and I want to show you guys, she gave me this really cute bracelet. It was handmade. And um, I want to show you guys. I don't wear this much because I'm not really, I used to be a bangles and bracelet person. But because I don't have time to doll up anymore, um, not as much, I um, don't wear bracelets as much as I do it as I used to. And then she gave me this really cute ballerina pin. And it's really, really gorgeous. It's really cute. So... That's that. And then I want to show you guys um, this drawer right here. I actually picked up from Goodwill for $10. Yes, $10. And um, I'm really actually excited to kind of renovate my apartment. The room just throws off everything because the closets are brown and it's just such a disgusting color. Uh, I'm trying to go with a black and white theme and kind of a lavender accent. So I can't wait. I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. Um, as usual, don't forget to subscribe to my channel here on YouTube. And I also have Instagram where you can follow me for all the picture updates. I do have a, a Facebook fan page where you guys can follow me for extra stuff. And as usual, follow me on Twitter. Alright, bye guys.